Hello all and welcome to today's video. My name is John McFall and I want to welcome you to the McFall RI channel where I teach you how to make $25 to $30 an hour doing food delivery and I also teach you how to make semi-passive income. In today's video, I want to talk to you about four different ways that you can make money online that are proven, they are tried and tested, and they can help you build a business online so that you can get your semi-passive income coming in and you can make the money that you want to make. These are uh, uh, some that you can jump into right away and you can get out there and get your hustle on and you can start making money with it. And before we get into the topic, I do want to remind you that in my description I have some great tools for you guys. The one I want to talk to you about first is TubeBuddy. If you have a YouTube channel or you're getting ready to start a YouTube channel and you want some great tools to help get more views, more likes, and more subscribers, TubeBuddy is a great tool and I'm going to throw a quick video up here so you guys can check it out. Whether you're looking to improve an existing YouTube channel or you're starting out fresh, TubeBuddy can help. This Google Chrome extension is a safe, convenient way to grow your following. SEO tools help you choose keywords to maximize visibility, while analytics give you precise insights into your channel's progress. You can edit thumbnails and descriptions en masse, or post videos to your Facebook without having to leave the site. It can even audit your content to help prevent devastating demonetization. You can try TubeBuddy for free but some features require a monthly subscription. Click the link below to learn more. I do want to let you know that if you do grab TubeBuddy in my description and get a paid version, I do get commission on it. But the great thing about TubeBuddy is you can start off by using it for absolutely free. And then as your channel grows and you need bigger and better tools to propel it even further, you can get into the paid versions and start to get even more out of it so that you can grow your YouTube channel and you can uh, get it going in the right direction. And with that, let's get into the topic. The first one that I want to talk to you about is freelancing. I'm going to throw a slide up here so you guys can kind of follow along with me, but freelancing is a great way for you to make some income. You can use websites like Upwork and like Fiverr if you have a skill, if you can do, let's say, website design or graphic design, or you're a writer, or you're an editor, or you're, uh, you know, you can produce uh, audio tracks. There are so many different things that you can do um, on these websites to get the income coming in that you want to get. And you can pick up gigs, you can pick up jobs and, and, and promote yourself on Fiverr and Upwork so that you can start to get clients coming in to be able to make the money that you want to make. I've done a video on Fiverr specifically, but it is very simple. You, you put together your profile, you, you put together basically your advertisement and, and you use pictures and videos and then you have a description that you fill out your information on. You set your pricing and you throw it out there so the people that are looking for that type of service can get on there and find you. And if you start out on one of these platforms and you do a good job for the customers that hire you, over time you will grow and it will help you get promoted more and more and more to make more money and to get an actual real business going through these platforms. You can get regular customers from them. You can get um, higher rankings on these platforms so that people find you and are able to uh, easily get in touch with you so that you can do work for them and you can make money for them. So make sure that you go check out uh, Fiverr and Upwork if you have some type of digital skill that you can use to um, make money and help people out because there's always people that are looking for them. The second one I want to talk about is being an influencer. And basically what an, influence, an influencer is, is that is somebody that is an expert in their field and you get online and you promote yourself and your expertise to other people and you can make a lot of good money on it. Influencers are on all social media platforms, whether it's Facebook or Instagram or Twitter or Snapchat or you know, YouTube, 
blogging. There are so many different angles that you can take to become an influencer and you can make money through being an influencer by selling your number one your time you can do coaching you can do courses you can um, do other things like affiliate stuff to make money as an influencer and this can really help set yourself up to make some really good income the one thing i do want to say about being an influencer is if you are just starting out it is going to take you a long time you have got to pump out a ton of content no matter what platform you're on until you start to get noticed and then once you start to get noticed that that growth will just snowball and and you'll get a lot more followers subscribers um, whatever the case might be depending on the platform and you can start making some really good money uh, from it but you've really got to put in the time and the effort up front to put together a great um, platform and, and content on that platform to get yourself noticed and then you can expand into other ones as you grow so your influence can grow even more and then once you get there then you can um, really ramp up what you're doing with the the different uh, income streams that you've put together so that you can make some really good money so if you're an expert at something or you're passionate about something you know a lot about something and you can share it with others being an influencer is a really great way to make income online. The third one that I want to talk about is something I've done a few videos on already, and this is Amazon. Amazon is such a good platform for you to get on because it is so well known that there are literally hundreds of thousands of people going on Amazon every single day to buy products and to buy books and to buy music and, and literally anything that people want to buy they go to Amazon to, to do that you can get into a couple of different things when it comes to Amazon if you are a, a very creative person and, and you have good ideas you can write and produce and, and publish books on Amazon you can self publish and it costs nothing to publish a book on Amazon they don't take any money from you until after you've actually started selling uh, books Another thing that I've done a video on is reverse wholesale merchandising, which is getting in touch with a, a manufacturer and, and getting products from manufacturers wholesale and then putting them on Amazon to sell them at a profit to make money. This type of business takes some investment up front because you have got to figure out what the minimum quantity a company is willing to sell at wholesale and you have to buy that quantity to um, sell it on Amazon and, and figure out what is going to be profitable for you. The third way that you can do it on Amazon is a video that I recently did and this is on retail arbitrage. This is literally going out into the, your, um, your, your city and going to the Walmarts and to the TJ Maxx's, the Burlington's, the Kohl's, the Macy's, all these different places. They have clearance racks because they want to get rid of the stuff that they haven't sold so they can make room for the new stuff. You can go into these places and, and simply have your phone and turn on Amazon and scan all the products that are on the clearance racks and you can find great products that you can make a lot of good profit on. The one thing about this type of thing is it takes you some time to, to go out and actually find the products that you want to sell. But the great thing about this type of business if you do retail arbitrage you can get started in it for very little money and then once you start selling stuff and making profits on it you can reinvest it until you can build up enough money to have a good inventory of stuff to start making really good money for yourself so think about going on to amazon because this could be a really great place for you to make really good money whether you're a book writer or or you want to sell products you can go on to amazon and and get it in front of people so that they buy it from you the fourth and the final one I want to talk to you about is coaching. If you are an expert in something, if you know something very well, you can make really good money at it. There are hundreds of thousands of coaches on this planet today and they are experts in what they know and people will pay them and you can jump on this bandwagon too and people will pay you to help them get from where they are to being successful at whatever it is they're interested in being successful at 
with coaching you can do a one-on-one -on -one. you can do an individual to individual you can also do what they call mastermind groups which is where you get a group of people together and teach them all at the same time and, and you can make really good money from it you can also put training together you can make courses in whatever you're an expert in and, and people will come to buy it um, because they want to know what you know people do not pay for the information that, that you have have. what they pay for is they pay for the organization they pay from getting from point A to point B to point C to point D and so on and so forth so if you you have the knowledge and you have the expertise you can put something together that people are willing to buy so these four ways you can get online and you can start making really good money whether it be freelancing be, whether it be being an influencer whether it be selling on amazon or whether it be coaching these are four ways that you can start making money with your semi-passive income business and you can get online and you can start getting yourself some income coming in so if you really want to start doing these types of things start doing your research on how to do them and start learning what you need to know to start your business i really hope that you learned a lot today and you got a lot of out of today's video don't forget to head down into my description and go grab tubebuddy if you got a youtube channel and you want to grow it faster it's a really great tool to use i've also got some other great tools in my description like bluehost and stash and there's a few others down there that uh, you might want to check out i want to leave you with i i would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel and like this video and i hope that you are getting the money that you and your family deserve and with that i want to say thanks